a very famous hard bat player. He's also top five in the vets in normal table tennis. Joey, how have you been getting on today? Today I've played in a group of ten. Uh, one eight out of ten. Oh, well yeah, done. Finishing third. Okay. Now you travel. You've travelled to the World Championships playing hard bat, haven't you? I have been to Holland two or three times. Okay. Again with the Dutch coming over here. And what makes you compete in this hard bat tournament? What do you enjoy about it? How does it compare to normal rubber? It's uh, the run is a lot longer. The competition's good. It's the old rules. Up to twenty one, up to three, five yeah. serves each. And the friendships you develop, uh, especially the Dutch guys. Yeah, I've really noticed a, a lovely atmosphere and everybody's really into it. Um, yeah, it really is. It's like uh, as a kid, I grew up watching a lot of hard back stuff. And, uh, it's trying to bring it back really. back to its roots. Yeah, definitely. And it, it, you know, we were speaking about this with Gary. It's a complete, and we call it the fair play tournament because everybody has the same back. So it's purely down to the skill of the player rather than their equipment. That's exactly right. So the person doesn't have to do the same. Uh, where the rubbers are. With spin and that doesn't come to it, it's down to the personal side. You know, playing a full stroke most of the time. You know, gone are the days of Inca Barn and Flick and Chopping, all these blokes can actually count a hit and smash through it. Yeah. It's moved on another gear to what they used to see on black and white on YouTube. It's yeah. really moved on. So, who's your money on taking the title today? Today, it'd be hard. I would say uh, Sule is in Nigeria. And he had a close match with Egglade, didn't he? He really did. It was yeah. like two points in it, and that's qualified. But the standard, it, it could be half a dozen players who could win it. But he'd be the top favourite. Uh, Billy Pegg's playing well. He, yeah. He's doing very well. He's got great technique, hasn't he? He, has, you know, he plays very much like he does with his yeah, normal, normal sponge, band. You know. And would you say this is the highest standard that you've seen? At the, it's at the there's, a, there's a Polish lad here I played with Brent, and he's normally he's an attacker of sponge. And here he defends and gets everything. It's fantastic, he's, phenomenal to watch. It really and he's is. not a normal defender. Not at all. I mean, you know, if the money could be on him, he's yeah. out of England, so like that. Okay. So, uh, Kasim's, you know, a good shout. But and Kasim's the current world champion. He is right? indeed, yeah. yeah. He's just lost he's one to really big in the team. Oh, yeah. yeah. So it's, it's going to be... It's going to get interesting. It's going to get interesting. You know, the total is going to be fantastic. Some of the stuff that has been played today has yeah. been awesome. But it's been fantastic for me to watch because obviously I used to play yeah. normal tables and I've never seen half that being played like this. And it's well, fantastic. It's really next time. Maybe next year. Watch out for me. Okay, well, thanks so much for joining me and good luck in the next round. I need it. Thanks very much. All right, cheers, Jamie.